Good morning. Today's session is Grammar a Passage, page 41 in the booklet. Read the passage, then answer. Omar, the shy boy, visits his aunt once a week. She is elderly and lives alone. Every week she waits for his visit. Each time, I love you, aunt, Omar said. She thinks Homer a wonderful nephew. She, visits his, uh, she loves his visits. He tries to be helpful and considerate in every way. His aunt doesn't hear well, so Homer speaks loudly and clearly when he is with her. When he is there, he, visit, he fix, fixes things for around her apartment and helps her with her shopping. He doesn't stay with her overnight. He usually stays for a few hours and then heads back to the city. He kisses his aunt goodbye and gives her a hug before she leaves. Unbelievable, Omar. How kind you are. Let's go for letter A. And space is a noun or a noun phrase that renames another noun. And what? And a positive. Okay. B. From the passage, pick out an appositive. What is the appositive here in this passage? Omer, the shy boy, visits his aunt once a week. Here, this is the appositive. Omer, the shy boy. The shy boy is the appositive. The appositive here, the shy boy. Okay, here, number C, letter C. Add another one of your own. Okay, we can say, Almer, the kind boy, visits his aunt once a week. Visits his aunt once a week. Okay. Two. Get out from the passage an introductory phrase. Before getting from the passage here, he wants the definition of introductory phrase. An introductory phrase is used to state a, to state a place, or you can get it from the box of the rule. To state a place, okay, or condition, Okay, and a time, a frequency or a fact before the main close of a sentence. And introductory phrases must be followed by a comma. Followed by a what? By a comma. Okay, that's the rule of the introductory phrase. Let's go. The rest of the passage is in page 42. Pick out an introductory phrase. He wants an introductory phrase from the passage. So here's the introductory phrase. Every week. Every week. Comma. She waits for his visit. She waits for his visit. C. Use the introductory phrase in a sentence of your own. For example, we can say uh, every morning. She takes her breakfast okay number three 
quotation marks we use quotation marks to show to show what let's return back to the rule to show exactly okay to show exactly what someone said or wrote what someone exact to show exactly what someone said or wrote use a comma at at the beginning and end of a person's exact words at the beginning and or end of person's exact words in a quotation let's go for b with reference to the passage pick out what refers to this they want a, a sentence that includes quotation mark uh, like here we have in the passage each time each time there's comma here and two inverted commas i love you aunt there is comma here and two inverted commas Omer said Omer said okay that's for the quotation marks let's go for number four is for interjection interjection is we said before that interjection is a word to use to express emotion or excitement is a word to express emotion or excitement excitement okay we have here in B pick out an interjection from the passage I want interjection from the passage is with letter B here I have here how kind you are how kind you are this is an interjection sentence and it, and it express uh, strong feelings okay that's today that's the lesson for today uh, i hope you enjoy the lesson thanks